Hello friends, welcome to my 30 range YouTube channel. Now Samsung officially released Samsung Galaxy A05s mobile in October on 2023. I already created this mobile unboxing and quick review video. You can watch this video on my channel. I add that video link on my video description. In this video, today we are going to talking about Samsung Galaxy A05s mobile top 10 tips and tricks. If you are using Samsung Galaxy A05s mobile, I think this video is very helpful to you. And if you are using Samsung A series mobile, these tips are very important to you. Okay, let's start our video. Let's learn how to enable double tap to turn on off screen option. If we enable this feature, when we double tap on our home screen, our lock screen going to turn off. Let's learn how to enable this feature. Go to your mobile settings. Scroll down this page and go to advanced features option. Click on motions and gestures option. In here, you can enable these two options, double tap to turn on screen option and double tap to turn off screen option. Okay, now I come to my home screen. After I double tap to my home screen like this, now my screen is going to turn off. Again, I can turn on my screen like this. If I double tap my home screen, it is going to turn on automatically like this. I think this is very good feature to use your mobile easily. Let's learn how to enable assistant menu icon to use this mobile very easily. If we enable this assistant menu icon, we can do lot of things very easily. I will show you how to do this. Go to mobile settings. Scroll down and go to accessibility option. Click on interaction and dexterity option. In here, you can enable assistant menu icon. You can view this ball icon, it has more options. You can customize this assistant menu button. Click on this assistant menu name. After click on select assistant menu items option. In here you can add items and unordered items in here. After you can customize this assistant menu icon as you like. We can open recent applications, we can capture screenshots, we can go back. Lot of features have on this assistant menu icon. I think this icon is very helpful to use your mobile easily. Let's learn how to record mobile e-screen. In the Samsung Galaxy A05s mobile not received pre-installed screen recorder. So we want to download third party application. Now let's download screen record application. Go to your mobile play store and search here X recorder. You can download this X recorder application. After you can set up it like this. Click on the settings icon on bottom right corner and go to audio settings you can enable this microphone and internal audio you can select audio recording mode in here now i select internal and microphone audios after you can select video resolution i select 1080p resolution Okay, after you can record a video using this X recorder like this. Now let's check our recorded video. This is our mobile screen recorded video. You can capture high resolution video using this X recorder mobile screen recording application. Let's learn how to hide navigation bar buttons and get full screen display. In this mode, we can see our recent key, home key and back key. We can hide this navigation bar buttons and we can get full screen display. To enable this feature, go to your mobile settings. Go to display option. In here, go to navigation bar option. Now I enable buttons method. You can change this button order. 
in bottom left side has recent key right side has back button in the second method you can change the back key and recent key position like this this is button method now let's hide this button to hide these buttons you want to enable this swap gestures method now you can see our navigation bar buttons are going to hidden in this gesture method has two options let's learn what are they click on this more options button first method is swap from bottom method and second method is swap from side and bottom option you can see the preview in here now i already enable second method swap from side and bottom option let's learn how it works if i want to go to home screen i can set my display middle bottom area like this now i can go to my home screen if i want to open recent applications i can swap and hold my finger to mobile display middle area after we can open recent applications if you want to go to back we can swap our screen side like this you can swap both side like this after you can go to back this is swap from side and bottom option let's learn other method other one is swap from bottom option now i enable it this is very easy if you want to go to back you can swap your screen bottom to up like this you can see a preview in here if you want to go to home screen you can swap your screen bottom middle area like this and if you want to open recent applications you can swap it like this when i enable this gesture method i like to use this swap from side and bottom option it is very easy to use on mobile and if we enable this gesture method our mobile has a great look it is very beautiful if you like to use full screen display you can enable this gesture method let's learn how to do multitasking in this multitasking mode we can use two application in one time let's learn how to use two applications in same time now i open some applications after click on your mobile recent key now select your application you want to multitask after click on this ball icon on the sap top middle area click on open in split screen view option okay now you want to select your another application now in this recent apps i am using settings if you have another recent apps you can select any applications in here and if you want to use your another applications in your mobile you can select the applications like this now i select settings okay now i can use these two applications in same time i can do my two works in same screen you can change this application position by clicking this icon and you can resize this application like this in this method you can use two application in one screen i think this is very good feature to you Let's learn how to capture a long screenshot. In this Samsung Galaxy A0 5S mobile, we don't want to download third party application to capture long screenshot. Normally, we can capture a screenshot by pressing volume down key and power key on same time. After we can capture a screenshot. Now, let's learn how to capture a long screenshot. In here, I cannot capture a long screenshot. so i open my mobile play store in here i can capture a long screenshot you can press your mobile volume down key and power key on same time after immediately press this down arrow icon now our screenshot is continually capturing you can see okay let's check our captured screenshot this is our long screenshot In this method you can capture a long screenshot very easily. Now this is bonus tip. I will tell you how to capture a screenshot without pressing your volume down key and power key. You can capture a screenshot using your mobile notification panel. Swipe down your notification panel. After you can see the e screenshot button. Now this mobile we cannot show this e screenshot button. 
so we want to add this to add this icon click on this plus button in here you can see available buttons take a screenshot you can drag and drop this take a screenshot button to your notification panel area okay after we can see take a screenshot button is appear on our notification panel now we don't want to press our volume down key and power key to capture a screenshot we can easily press this take a screenshot button and we can capture a screenshots like this i think this is is very helpful to you let's learn how to enable one handed mode if we enable this one handed mode we can use our mobile easily using our one hand let's learn how it works and how it enable go to your mobile settings scroll down this page and go to advanced features option you can enable this one handed mode now let's learn how it works click on this one handed mode option in this one handed mode have two options one is gesture method and second one is button method in this gesture method we can enable this one handed mode like this you can see a preview in here we want to tap down our mobile home button like this after we can enable this one handed mode using this gesture method you can move this window like this you can resize this if you want to exit on this one handed mode you can tap your mobile blank area like this okay this is gesture method let's try this button method now i enable buttons method in this button method we want to double tap our home button after we can easily enable one handed mode I think this button method is very easy to enable one handed mode because we want to double tap our home screen and we can easily enable this one handed mode. If you are using this one handed mode, I recommend to use button method because it is very easy to enable this one handed mode. Let's learn how to enable internet speed meter. When we are using a mobile, we want to know how many data we are using. If we enable this internet speed meter, we can identify how many data we are used. In this Samsung Galaxy A05s mobile not received pre-installed internet speed meter. So we want to download third party application on our Play Store. Let's learn how to enable this internet speed meter. Go to mobile Play Store and search here internet speed meter. You can install this internet speed meter light application. I recommend to use this application. It is very good. After the first opening, you can give permissions and you can allow these settings. Okay, after you can close this application. Now, when you tap your notification panel, you can see your internet speed meter. You can see the mobile usage and Wi-Fi usage. Now, I am used 28.8 megabyte on my wi-fi connection you can see it increased in this method you can enable internet speed meter on your a05s mobile let's learn how to enable dual messenger applications if you want to use two whatsapp applications two facebook accounts two messenger applications we can enable this option using this mobile default settings we don't want to download app clone applications on play store let's learn how to do this go to mobile settings scroll down this page and go to advanced features option click on dual messenger option in here you can see your mobile available applications now in this mobile i installed facebook application only so the available applications is only facebook on my phone if you install whatsapp viber emo or any other messenger applications you can see the available apps in here to install dual facebook applications you can enable this facebook app after you can install second facebook application okay second facebook application already installed let's check our two facebook applications this is my one facebook application this is my second facebook application in this method you can install two messenger apps on your mobile 
Let's learn how to reduce animations and speed up your mobile. When we open applications, we can see a small animation preview. We can disable this animation preview and speed up our mobile. Let's learn how to do this. Go to mobile settings. Scroll down and go to accessibility option. Go to visibility enhancement option. In here, you can enable this remove animations option. Now let's check the difference. Now I press my home key. You can see no any animation preview. It close very very fast. Now I open again some application. It has not any animation preview. It opening very fastly. Okay, in this method, you can remove your mobile apps animation and speed up your mobile. Okay, in this video, let's learn Samsung Galaxy A0 5S mobile top 10 tips and tricks. If you want to know any other tips and tricks or any other features on this mobile, please add your comments. I will create more videos for you. If you are using Samsung Galaxy A0 5S mobile or Samsung A series mobile, I think these tips are very important to you. And if you like to know more tips and tricks on this Samsung Galaxy A0 5S mobile, you can go to our channel playlist and go to Samsung Galaxy A0 5S playlist. After you can watch all tips and tricks videos on this Samsung Galaxy A0 5S mobile. If you like to know more tips and tricks on this Samsung Galaxy A0 5S mobile, you can subscribe to our channel. I will upload more tips and tricks on future videos. If you like this video, please press the like button and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click the bell icon. Okay, so goodbye all of you. Let's meet on our next A05S video.